We're going to move on now to our GMA cover story. It's shining a light on pancreatic cancer awareness and action in the wake of Alec Trebek's passing. Dr. Jen Ashton joins us right now. And Jen, Alex actually did well, it appeared, for, for quite some time with pancreatic cancer, but it's such a deadly yeah. disease. In general, absolutely, George. You know, um, it's on track by the year 2025 to be the second leading cause of cancer deaths in the U.S. behind lung cancer. And part of the reason it tends to be so deadly has to do with anatomy. If you look at where the pancreas is located, it sits high up in the abdominal cavity. You can't palpate it or feel it on a physical exam. And by the time it's producing symptoms uh, like yellowness of the skin or eyes or uh, weight loss, it's generally metastasized or spread to an advanced stage. So those are two of the warning signs? Yeah, you know, I mean, it, it can produce vague symptoms. That's part of the problem, and there's no screening test for it. But the good news is there are more treatment options than ever, mainstays of treatment, depending on stage and the health of the person, of course, surgery, chemotherapy, radiation therapy. But then there's a whole new class of so-called targeted therapies, things using uh, PARP inhibitors, they're called, or checkpoint inhibitors, usually attached to a major cancer center. But in oncology, there is always reason for optimism and hope. And with pancreatic cancer, uh, the same thing applies. And is there anything people can do to reduce their risk of contracting pancreatic cancer? Well, well, some of these things are under our control, so there's a long list. It starts with the basics. Don't smoke. Keep your diet and weight in a healthy range. Exercise is really important. And then the things that we can avoid, limit, or minimize, things like a lot of processed or red meat, heavy alcohol or sugar use, or certain chemical workplace exposures. Again, some of these things under our control. Some of them are not. The BRCA1 and 2 mutation that people think about with breast and ovarian cancer also can increase the risk of some cases of pancreatic cancer. So again, Alex Trebek showing us inspiration and increasing awareness even after he's gone. Jen Ashton, thanks very much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.